Okay, today I thought I would show you in Photoshop how to easily merge the red, green and blue channels of a mono captured image in order to get a fully functioning and workable red, green, blue image. Uh, from that point in time, you can then start uh, processing your image. But assuming you have a mono camera and then you are going to end up with a stack of separate channels that you're going to need to uh, to merge and to blend. The assumption I've made from this point is that your channels are registered and aligned together. Um, I understand that this can be done in DSS, that's Deep Sky Stacker, but I haven't used that for some time, so you just would need to uh, have a check on that or use another software of choice in order to do that. But as I say, you absolutely must make sure that they're aligned, otherwise this will not work. Okay, as you can see here, I have open three channels. I've got the blue channel open, the green channel open, and the red channel open. These have been taken with a mono CCD camera. They're a stack of, mm, I don't know, probably about three hours in total of the red, the green, and the blue filter. Incidentally, it happens to be M33, but you won't see anything looking like that, so that's uh, totally irrelevant at this point in time. Okay, <clears throat> what I'd like you to do is to go down to the channels tab, which is down here on the right hand side of the screen and click on it. And then on the right hand side of there, you have a drop down menu, which you can click on. And then there's simply merge channels. Click on that and that throws up this box here. What we're looking at, at mode is drop down menu and we're going to click RGB color. And that informs you that RGB color is going to be made up of three channels. Click OK. And from there, we specify the channels that we're going to merge. Um, these haven't been opened up in the correct order, so we're going to need to make sure we put them in the right place. Here, as you can see, you've got the red, the green and the blue channel. And you click the drop down menu on red and you select your red channel. Go to green, select the green channel go to blue and select the blue channel. So as you can see in here, we've got the red, the green and the blue all in the right place. Click OK. And hey presto, we now have got one image and that is a merged image giving you a red, green and blue image. You can see that if you look down here again at the channels, you can see that here. You've got RGB and that is made up of red, green and blue. From there, we then start to process it. So I would then be clicking on layers and then start stretching. But that's going to be for another tutorial. I just wanted to show you this really, really simple process um, because up until now I have struggled with this. I'm embarrassed to say and have continually used Noel's actions or Annie's actions in order to do it. But this works a treat. So I thought I'd let you know and hope that you find it useful. OK, thank you very much.